Hi guys and welcome back to another spooky box unboxing. This month's box is basic witches. So I literally have no idea what's going to be in this. I'm hoping witch themed obviously. Um, let the car go by. So last month's box I wasn't super happy about. And mainly because I want to try and sell um, a lot of the stuff. Um, the nail file. The compact mirror I have it wrapped up. Um, this doesn't fit my head, unfortunately. It's the the thing to keep your hair out of your face when you're doing your makeup or doing a treatment. And the little brush that was really crap. So if anyone wants to buy this, let me know. Um, and I will see about sending it your way. Um, I'm not too sure how much I'm looking for it, but I'll try and do it as cheap as I can because I know shipping is really annoying. But basically, um, I'm trying to get rid of all of those. Otherwise, they're just gonna go to a charity shop or whatever. The hair towel thing, um, I actually use it and I'm after using it quite a lot. I only just used it last night and I really actually like it. I didn't think I would, but I really do. Now, that being said, if you have more hair than me, I don't have a lot of hair right now and it just, it just fits my head. When I get more hair, it's probably not going to be no good for me. So it's sad to say that it's such a small size of a, a hair towel. But I am getting use out of it now, which is the important thing. And then I did love the pin and everything in the last one. But you can watch um, the last unboxing um, if you just have a look through my Spooky Box unboxings or just my videos. But I just wanted to update you guys about it because the towel I did use quite a lot. Anyway, back to... Wrong way. <laughs> back to Basic Witches. This is box 52 and it's just a very simple sticker it's like um kind of a typewriter font as well so let's get opening i'm going to blindly do it so i'm just going to let you guys see but also try and not look myself i see the sheet with all the stuff written on it i'm just going to leave it there i see a lot of bubbly things i'm going to take them out as well so it feels quite like a light um a very fairly light box which is sad because when they're light usually they're not great Basic witches, I did think maybe there might be a mug in here, which <laughs> on the one hand I love mugs, on the other hand I have too many right now at the moment. So um, let's just see what the first thing I pull out is. It's this. Oh, what's this? Oh, it's like a badge. It's a witch badge. <laughs> okay, I'm not too sure how I feel about this, but I do kind of like it. Hang on now when we get it out. So it's like... Um, when you win a prize or that and you get a little witch badge and it's actually quite nice i actually i actually do like that at all so i do like that at all i do quite like that okay i'm just noticing that mine's a bit um i don't know if you can see yeah you can see it there it's like got um damage to it so i may have to contact them for one that doesn't have all that on it but this is quite nice and it's just got like a a pin back on it so I could pin it on me sorry about all the traffic noises but I have to have the window open because it's so hot that's why I haven't done a full face of makeup because it's so hot but yeah that's cute um it probably would get a loss a bit in black clothing but it's still quite nice and unusual we haven't really got on like this um before I don't think you know our jewelry our badges have been just regular ones, nothing really like this. Okay, there's a box. What will be in it? It's long. We'll be let you see first. Ta-da! Ooh! Are they all earrings? What are they? <gasps> They're all earrings! Now that is pretty nice. That is really nice. So they're just silver. And it's obviously the like the eclipse, and um, you've got the full moon, and then quarter and half, and whatever the crescent, and all of that. And um, yeah, they're all individual earrings. We've got earrings I did before that were bats, and those ones I actually just want to move this a bit. Those ones I actually use quite a lot because I love them a lot. But this is this is quite cool. I actually really like that that is really nice okay next i'm assuming there's gonna be black is the team okay this is their thank you card i knew by the feel of it 
This is something in a baggie, a necklace. Ooh, let me see. It's diamondy kind of shaped. It's on a fairly long necklace and it's yeah, it's it's okay. It does the metal looks a bit cheap. Um, but it is quite nice, so it's like silver metal and I've got um, the moon, crescent moons up on the bottom and I assume they're supposed to be full moons, the little round bits. And then it's got a nice little stone in it and I don't know what that stone is called. But it does look kind of cheap, they have Spooky Box Co on the back, but like I said, it does look a bit cheap, but it is nice, and um, it has a chain. Actually, this is a different kind of a chain that I've seen before. Very, very thin hoops, but they do have a clasp, so you can adjust it a bit. But um, it's okay. It's definitely not one of my favorites, but it's nice. Okay, oh, there's something big here. Oh, is this, is this like a tumbler or something? A cop, yeah. We got, right. We got one like this before, but it was one of the clear ones. No, one of the one of the clear ones. Yeah, it was kind of like that, wasn't it? I just can't remember exactly how it was. And um, it looked very similar to this, so... I don't know how I feel about it. There was a blue bottle in here. Get out. There is a blue bottle in here, so if you hear that, it's a stupid fly. They're driving me up the wall. My God, they're just everywhere. Anyway, it says Thir Thirsty Witch on it. It's for coffee, I think, isn't it? These type of ones are for like tea or coffee. Um, I actually don't drink coffee. I drink herbal teas, but that's all. Like, I can give it a try, see how I get on, but definitely not. I, I just, Thirsty Witch. Thirsty bitch. <laughs> I suppose that's what it's supposed to be like. And it says spooky box cone and it's on both sides. It's kind of matte. Um, I don't know if you can see. So I do feel like it might get scratched up quite easily. Um, and I kind of, I just would have rather, like there's one going around the TK Maxx right now. The Halloween stuff is starting to trickle in. So in some TK Maxx's we've seen one of these, but it's white and it's got bats all over it. And I swear I need that so bad. You know, that's what I would like more than this. Um, yeah, I don't know. I I don't know how I feel. I'll see if I use it, how I get on with it. It's just one of those things. <laughs> I don't know what that was supposed to be around, but it's loose, whatever it is. Oh, this is a patch. We haven't got a patch in ages. What does it feel like? A broom handle, possibly? I'm excited. Oh no, that's not. That's totally not anything I thought it was. Okay, what way is this supposed to be? Oh, this way. As above, so below. Now, I have to say, this is quite unusual, but I really like it. Um, I've never really seen anything like it. It's a hand, it's got a little heart on it just there. It's got poofy sleeves and it says, as below, oh my God, as above, so below. And she's got like a ring on her finger, like if it's, if it's a lady hand. And um, I actually really like that. It's quite kind of classic and kind of nearly Victorian style or something like that. And I have to say, it kind of doesn't fit in with the other items that we've got right now. Like, I feel like these don't really fit together. This is more modern, but this is more kind of Victorian or that. But I do really love it. Um, I don't think I've ever got a patch from them that I didn't like. And it's a video that I want to do soon. I actually might do a haul of like all the patches that I have and start putting them on clothes because um, they're so nice. Yeah, it's really, really nice. And it's a, I think it's an iron on. You can feel the stuff on the back. So yeah, that's really nice. Next. Lolly. There's the lollipop. Oh. That looks really nice. That looks like it might be strawberry and cream or something like that. I hope it is because it looks really good. Um, we'll keep that aside anyway for now. Okay, we've got something. What is this? Are these hair clips? Oh! Celestial moon and stars witchy hair adornments. Oh no. 
it was like, oh, they look nice. And then I got a look at them and they look so cheap and tacky. Oh no. Wait, I'll just show you what I mean. I would have liked if they had been just been clear. They look really tacky. Um, can you guys tell? Not really. I'll try and get a close up on it. I'll just take one out. Um, yeah, they just have this this thing that I can never really understand. Oh, geez, that's not very strong. It might come out. But they look really tacky. Kind of like this stuff you'd find in the two euro shop. You can see it a bit better there. It's looking a lot sparklier than it actually. It's not sparkly at all. Um, it, the, like I suppose when when they're like I have no hair to put them in, so that's the only problem. Like they literally, I have no hair for it to grab onto. But like maybe when it's in the hair, it might look better. Okay, my hair is definitely not happy, but um. These are slides. I suppose they look quite nice when they're on their own. No, they're looking nicer in the video. That's what's wrong. Like I'm looking at what I'm seeing now and they look a lot nicer than what they look like. They just look really tight. You know when you're a kid and you buy jewelry for yourself? Well, no, you buy kids jewelry or whatever and it has like little, uh, they're being bedazzled. That's what it looks like. Um, I wonder does anybody I want to watch some other people's unboxings and see do they do they see what I'm seeing I don't know I will try and get footage like obviously inserted and hopefully it will show what I'm talking about but um this is very flimsy this um but the slides do look quite nice I'm like like that slide on its own would look really good this is a bit too blingy <laughs> but they're not they're not great okay they're not great. Let's go on. I think this might be a print. Ooh. Know your power. Oh, that's nice. I like that print a lot. I'm not going to... Oh, well, should I take it out? No, I won't take it out. Because you can see. Yeah. It says, not your power. And it's a witchy hand. It looks awesome. With witchy nails. And then we've got all different kind of um, tattoos on it. And a ring. Oh, there's loads of rings, actually. There's all different kind of rings. I love the eye there. Yeah, that's really nice. It's quite simple. Um, I like it a lot. So that's all that was in it. I'm gonna go down through everything now. I do feel like, yeah, I feel like this was out of place. Um, I feel like that would have fit in so well with like a Victorian box had they done one. I think they done one before. I can't remember. Anyway, Swiggy Box Club, Basic Witches, box number 52. So custom made thirsty witch travel cup. That's this. So I'll see if I get any use out of it. Um, like it's it's okay. It definitely could have done with maybe a better design. Seeing as the other tumbler, that, that's what it was. It was a tumbler that we got the last time. Did it have a straw as well? It may have had, and it was very similar to this. I just feel like it was similar. So I just would have liked maybe a different design on it. But I'll see if I use it. Custom made moonstone necklace. Um, it's a nice necklace, but definitely um, looks very cheap. I would wear it, but it looks very cheap. <laughs> um, I can't say that that would be worth a lot. Witchy moon and star, witch, witchy moon and star hair adornments. Okay, this is interesting because this doesn't say custom made, so I'm guessing they bought them cheap somewhere bulk bought them so i'm wondering aliexpress somewhere like that would you find them and is that why they look so cheap i just they look so cheap i don't know this was nice the card that it was on <laughs> um this was really nice it says custom silver plated brass with pay of crystal settings but it doesn't say that it's custom made on this everything that's custom made it says it so, mm -hmm. I don't know. Know Your Power Witchy Art Print. I really like this. Um, I have so many art prints that I keep trying to frame, but they're kind of an awkward size to try and get a frame for, but I'll have to keep an eye out anyway. Um, custom Made Witch Black Ribbon Pin. Um, I do quite like this. I think it's nice. I was just thinking you could put it on your bag as well. You could really put it on anything you wanted. 
um yeah i think i think this looks quite nice i am quite happy with it except for just the little mark on it so i might just let them know and see if they can send me another one or something because it is quite a noticeable dent in it um custom made as bill as above so below embroidered patch so this is really nice Do you know what vibes it's given me as well pennywise um from it that yeah yeah it's kind of reminding me kind of like a clown or something too this i really love i do really like it and it's this kind of drawing and print and stuff that i i want to see more of you know i feel like we don't see the artwork as much and you kind of want them incorporated into the items more personally for me anyway custom made stainless steel moon phase studs so these were really nice um yeah these are really lovely i definitely would get use out of them um because i it would be really nice as well if you've got a lot of piercings you can put a few in um i obviously only have my lobes pierced but like I could wear any of those to um, mismatching or anything like that and they'd look really nice. So I really like those ones. They're really nice. And then it says lollipop suitable for vegetarians. So it doesn't let us know what kind of lollipop it is or anything. It's got something written on it. Just the calorie information but it doesn't say where it's from. So overall, overall this was okay. I definitely... Think it could have been better but i don't hate it either i quite like i really i want to try this out see if i use it um i love the earrings i'll wear the necklace even though it is cheap the hair things maybe not so much you know i'm a bit disappointed with them the patch i loved the print i loved so and and this i do love this i could, could definitely see myself getting attached to this little guy um <laughs> so yeah overall um I think I quite liked it, but then some didn't hit the nail on the head, but yeah, that was all right. That was pretty good. So guys, um, I don't know what the next one is. Is it is it the Get Lost one or something? Is the next one? I don't know. Um, I'm so behind. I never know what's next, but I will see you then for that spooky box unboxing. Until then, I have loads of vlogs. I have some DIY videos coming up. I will have lots coming up, hopefully, very soon. If the heat will let me do anything, because it's so hot, I can't be dealing with this heat. It's just... Anyway, I'll see you in my vlogs, and um, bye.